Media boss Lachlan Murdoch has launched defamation proceedings against the publishers of news website Crikey. Let's go live now to Jake Lapham in Sydney. Jake, good morning. So why has Lachlan Murdoch taken this action? Good morning, Michael. Well, this concerns an article published in Crikey linking the Murdoch family with the January 6 attack on the United States Capitol. It was an analysis piece penned by political editor Bernard Keane in which the Murdoch family are named as, quote, unindicted co-conspirators in that attack. And that's what's prompted Lachlan Murdoch to launch these defamation proceedings. He believes that um, it damaged his reputation and furthermore, an, an open letter in the New York Times Times uh, published by Crikey left him humiliated and harmed. Now, for Crikey's part, it believes that when uh, Murdoch is referenced, the most readers would interpret that as Rupert Murdoch and not Lachlan Murdoch, and they say they will vigorously uh, defend this defamation suit. Earlier this week, uh, a range of legal letters between Lachlan Murdoch and Crikey were published by the publication on their website in quite an unprecedented, uh, basically, challenge to. Lachlan Murdoch to follow through on that legal threat and that appears to be what he's done overnight with a statement of claim in the federal court. Crikey's editor Peter Frey released a statement last night urging Lachlan Murdoch to quote bring it on and he says that the, that the stories will be, will be defended in the public interest and in accordance with press freedom. Michael we don't have a court date for this just yet but no doubt it's one we'll be following very closely going forward. Very interesting case indeed Jake thank you so much.